Get a glimpse at your 2020 by booking your 2020 yearly reading that will be sent to you through a personalized link all through email. All you have to do is just email me at pinkoratero at gmail.com. Welcome back to Pink Oratero. My name is Z. This is a general reading for all Pisces for January 2020. So happy new year to all Pisces. I'm really excited to do your reading for January 2020 just to see what's in store for you for this new year of 2020. So Pisces, oh yeah, also please do not make these messages apply to your personal life. These messages are very general. They may or may not resonate with everyone. If they do resonate with you, feel free to leave a nice comment below and also subscribe to my channel um, to check out more readings. So Pisces, let's get right into it. So January 2020, you guys have Meditation Brings Answers. And then you guys have improving health. And then you have yes. And then you have be assertive. And at the bottom of the deck, we have perfect timing. And I just realized that um, below perfect timing, it's a weight and then I'm going to show the next card because when I was like um, trying to see what the message was. So it says no need to worry. So this is going right into what I'm about to say for Pisces. So Pisces, it seems like for some of you guys, you could have been for some of you guys, you could have definitely been um, working on your mental health. Not saying that anybody has like mental health issues, but for some of you guys, you could have been like, um, you could have, you could have been doubting yourself. Um, there were just like a lot of mental things going on. It could, you could have been telling yourself no about a certain situation. So for some of you guys, you could have actually, for some of you guys, you could be actually getting into meditation. If you're somebody, somebody who doesn't really know how to meditate, um, Maybe you seen something online about improving, um, about improving like your mental health. Cause with this improving health card and then like meditation brings answers, I'm thinking like mental health. So for some of you guys, you could be getting into, um, the habit of practicing meditation also too to improve your health. Um, so that could be mental health or physical health also too. Because meditation has like a lot of benefits to it. But for some of you guys, it's like you could have really been dealing with something like mentally. So um, something could have had you like mentally tied up. Maybe you were like trapped in your own head, thinking like really negative about your situation. And so for some of you guys, by you actually getting into the habit of um, meditating, that improve your mental health. Or like it kind of um, gave you like a different outlook on your situation. So it's like you started telling yourself yes. And also too, with this be assertive, it's like once you started telling yourself a yes, it's like you um, with this be assertive. I feel like it's like you being assertive with your um, with yourself also too. This could be other people, like towards other people. But I feel like this is more so like. Um, you being assertive with yourself, like being honest with yourself. So this could definitely be someone who feels like they're like trapped in a situation also too. Maybe you feel tied down to something. And also too, for some of you guys, you could have been waiting for something. Somebody could have been like very worried about a situation and you could have been um, worried about it. But with this perfect timing, it's like whatever this is that you're waiting for is coming in the perfect timing, like um, in divine timing. So let's get into the um, tarot. Give me one for meditation brings answers, please. Give me one for meditation brings answers. 
for Pisces. Anyone for meditation brings answers for Pisces. So we have the strength card. Yeah. For some of y'all, you could have been manifesting something and maybe it wasn't coming in the timing that you wanted it to. We have the magician card at the bottom of the deck. For some of you guys, you, yeah, you could have been um, trying to manifest something. And maybe you felt like it wasn't coming. We have the strength card right here for meditation brings answers. So, yeah, it's like someone didn't have like the mental strength also, too, about a situation. Or maybe you, you weren't um, as confident about something. So this could be mental health and also physical health also too. But it's like someone's really um, getting into the habit of improving their health. So you could be um, going to the gym a lot also too. Um, also too, somebody, you could be... For some of y'all, you could be doing some, you know, like New Year's resolutions or whatever. So that could be one of the things that you're trying to improve. Or like one of the goals that you set for yourself is to like improve your health. Give me one for improving health. Yeah. So this is, I feel like this is like mental. So it's like some of you guys could have been very confused about something with this, um, this seven of cups. So this could definitely be some kind of like mental health, um, issue. Not saying that it's like bad or anything, but it's like someone could have been really struggling like mentally. With the seven of cups. Also too with the seven of cups. Um, this has something to do with like drugs also too. With the seven of cups. Um, mm. For some of y'all, you could have been taking um, some kind of medication also, too, with that Seven of Cups. For some of you guys, you could have been, like, prescribed some kind of, like, medic, um, some kind of medication to um, improve your health. Or you could be on some kind of medicine also, too. What's, Yes. Give me one for yes. Give me one for yes. Okay, I just want one card. Hold on for one second. <clears throat> yeah. So we have this, um, the eight of cups. So for some of you guys, it's like maybe you walked away from something. For some of you guys, you could have been on medication also too. Somebody could have been taking some sort of like medication. And so maybe you, um, for some of you guys, you could have let that go. And you could be getting uh, more, uh, more into like spirituality also too. You could start meditating also too. Give me one for be assertive. So we have the Wheel of Fortune card. So this could be um, in regards to love also. So we have the Lovers card at the bottom of the deck. So um, Pisces, for some of you guys, I feel like since you um, walked away from something or it's almost like someone put something down, 
Um, you could have stopped using something, some sort of like medication to improve your health or made some sort of decision to, um, to, um, somebody could have made like a extreme, um, somebody could have did something extreme to improve their health also too. So maybe you guys said yes to, um, this decision that you had to make and walked away from it, or it's like someone put something down. And so I feel like since you did that, you walked away from something or this could have, you could have walked away from a, a person also too. But it's like now that you're being true to yourself and being assertive with yourself and other people around you, it's like with this Wheel of Fortune card, it's like things are going to be going in your favor. Whatever this like choice was or like whatever option that you had to improve your health also too. It's like now that you're being honest with yourself, being more assertive with yourself, not being scared to ask for what you want and you're not watering anything down. You have the will of fortune card. So um, things are going to be changing for you. Like things are going to be going in your favor. And then we have the lover's card at the bottom of the deck. So this could have been about a partnership or a relationship. Some of you guys could have been dealing with a Gemini. So um, for the energy oracle card, we have all tied up. And so with this all tied up, uh, I'm going to read the meaning for that. Um, hold on for a second. So it's number 23. So yeah, all tied up. This is like, um, it means lack of emotion. So some of you guys could have felt stuck in a situation. But also too, with this all tied up, I feel like it's, it's mentally also too. So this could have been mentally or physically also too. And you could have been all tied up in what you thought was a caring connection also too. So yeah, I'm just going to leave the reading right here. Hopefully these messages help someone out. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe and um, share this video with someone. Share this video with another Pisces. <laughs> so yeah, um, also make sure you hit the notification bell also too to um, get more readings. Or so you won't miss out on any readings.